Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, welcome to my channel. So today I'm just doing a basic get ready with me. Um, as you can see, I'm just dressed casual. I'm going to run some errands. I'm going to go and see my mom and spend some time with her. And that's about it. I just thought I'd pick up the camera and start recording. That way I can get some content out. Um, but it's going to be a basic glam. And if you have not subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. That way you don't miss any future uploads. And today I'm going to be using the LA Girl Mastery Eyeshadow Palette. So I'm going to use this today. There's a lot of neutrals in here. So this is the colors here. And I'm going to go ahead and set my face. Um, so I'm still going to do this. I'm going to go ahead and set my face and then I'll do my eyeshadow. And I'm going to switch up the eyeshadow primer today. I'm just going to use the Believe Beauty Eyeshadow Primer. I hope everyone is doing well. It looks like it's going to be a beautiful day. Sun is shining. It's going to be around 60 degrees. So I can't complain. All right. So I'm just going to take this palette here. I'm just going to dip into like a couple colors here for transition colors. And I do apologize if I sound a little bit raspy. I think my allergies are kicking in. So sometimes it affects my voice. So, you know, your voice tends to get raspy when the weather changes. All right. And then with the same brush, I'm just going to go in with this brown color here. I'm going to build it up a little bit more. I'm not doing a big glam or anything today. Again, I'm just doing a basic get ready with me. So I don't have anybody to impress. So I'm just putting on a basic face. All right, and then I'm just gonna take like this um, darker purple here and this like a lighter color here. So like this darker purple and this lighter mauve color. I'm just gonna mix those two and put that on my eyelid here. That's the good thing with makeup. You can always just play with it and see what colors you can create. So just mix everything around. Alright, so that's pretty much the look here. I'm like I said, I'm just doing a basic glam. And that's it. And then I'm gonna go ahead and prime my face. And I'm going to use the professional primer. So as you guys know, I have to have pore filling primers. I have larger pores, and they just tend to work better on my skin. So And it looks like my nose is sunburnt, but it's not. I have a nice little friend there that just decided to pop up. All right, so now that that has set in, we're gonna go ahead and do the under eyes. I'm gonna go ahead and conceal the under eyes. I'm still using my e.l.f. Hydro Camo Concealer in Tan Walnut.
All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and blend this out with my finger as usual. I'm gonna go ahead and blend it out and then apply my foundation. I know I look crazy right now, but trust the process. Everything will blend itself out. It'll all wash out in the end. All right, and then for today, I'm going to be using the L'Oreal Infallible Fresh Wear Up to 24 Hour Foundation. Of course, I don't wear my makeup that long, but I'm gonna use this today. I haven't used it in a while, so I figured I'd go ahead and switch it up a little bit. And I'm just gonna put it on my brush here. Just put two pumps on my brush. I love this foundation. It's full coverage and it's it's very nice. I like it. It's buildable too. Like if you start off with just like a little bit, you can just put another pump on there and you're like your beat. Like it's very full coverage. I don't know about you guys, but I know everybody here is all excited about the eclipse. I will be working on that day, so I may sneak off and open my door or whatever and have my shades on and look out there and see what's going on, but we'll see. So make sure you have your shades and make sure you have your water. Um, but I know it's a very exciting time all over the world. So it will be neat. Yeah, I may just go out there and take a look and see what's going on. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and set my under eyes. I'm still using that CoverGirl Clean and Clear Invisible Translucent Powder. All right, so now that my eyes are set, I'm just gonna go ahead and set my face with the same powder. I'm just taking my brush, dipping into the lid, tapping off the excess. I'm just gonna go ahead and set my face here. I just love the finishing of the translucent powder because for those of you who like do, then I'm sure, you know, you save yours for last, but the ones that don't like to do, you know, you're feeling good like me and can mattify your skin a little bit. I like the powder look, fresh powder look. All right, so we're gonna go ahead in with bronzer and blush. So I'm just using the Physician's Formula still. I'm using the deep bronzer. I want to learn how to do that contour. I don't know how to contour. Like using liquid bronzers and stuff and contouring your nose and stuff. I have no idea how to do it. I'm going to practice it though. I'm going to put that on here. I'm going to practice it. So don't laugh at me. That'll be something that you'll see here in the near future. All right. As far as blush goes, I'm going to use the Milani Baked Blush. Um, this one is in Bella Bellini. I had posted a video yesterday. And I think it was a soft glam video and I didn't use this blush. I was looking back at the footage and I was like, I didn't even use the blush, but we're going to use it today. So we're using the soft glam, uh, the soft glam. We are using the Milani Bella Bellini blush. I love this color. It's a real pretty pink color and it looks like it has like a shimmer in there as well that could pass for like your highlighter. So I'm just going to use this. I don't know why, but it seems like one side always shows more than the other. Maybe it's just me. It could be the lights too, so that could be it. All right, so that is on there. And we're gonna go ahead and do mascara and we're gonna do our lower lash line. 
All right, so for mascara, I'm gonna use the Essence Lash Princess Curl and Volume. Still loving this bad boy here. I wanna get me another Thrive Cosmetics. I know that that's a really good brand too. I used to have one. I used to have a mascara and that gives you some mega length. But these Essence ones are good too, so. So that's, I mean, that's pretty good. And that's just one coat. That's why I like Essence too. See, you know, it's kind of clumpy. So when that happens, I know somebody had asked me about clumpy mascara. Sometimes it clumps and I got something in my eye. So when your mascara clumps, what I like to do, because sometimes it does that, I just take it and just do this to the mascara because sometimes there's just too much product on there. And I can see there's a little hair on there too. So sometimes that happens, that's with makeup, but take it and just comb it on there, comb the excess off on the tube. Um, and then I go back in there I'll go back in there with the mascara after I comb it out on the tube and then go back over it. And if it's still clumping, then either A, you need a new mascara, you know, cause sometimes the mascaras are old. I think the mascaras only last like six, I'm not for sure if it's six months, three months or whatever, let me see, six months. So if you look at the back of your mascara, it does tell you, you'll see the little, you'll see the little lid and it says six months. So sometimes they clump up whenever you need to change your mascara, when it's time for you to switch mascaras. So that could be it too. And then what I'll do is I'll go ahead in with my eyeliner as well and try to minimize that because it does happen. That's, that's the thing with makeup, it does happen. So I'm gonna go ahead and try and minimize that a little bit. So lashes are lined and then we'll go ahead and put on some lipstick and that's pretty much it for this video. And I'm still using my Sol Genera lipstick in Soulmate. I love this. I might have to give me another one. Like I said, this smells like chocolate chip cookies and it's very creamy, very moisturizing too. And it doesn't give you a sticky finish like on the edge of your mouth. So that's good. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and lock everything into place. I'm still loving this Black Radiance Matte Setting Spray. So I'm gonna use this, shake it up. All right, guys, this completes the look. I hope you enjoyed today's video. It's just a casual get ready with me, but it's still something. So I hope you guys have a good weekend. Enjoy your day. Um, I will have more content loading. Please subscribe if you have not subscribed already. And as always, stay blessed.